Hello, my name is Tunch. I'm founder of Fina Quant Analytics. I will explain today what a table function is and then talk about topics like our .NET libraries comprising table functions. We have a commercial .NET library named Finaquant Calls, which includes calculation nodes and networks in addition to table functions. I will also mention what these nodes and networks are for. Finaquant Calls is a .NET library for table computations. It has two primary features. First, table functions and second, calculation nodes and networks. These two features make FinaQuant Calcs a calculation engine based on table functions. If you ask, what can I do with this .NET library? My answer is, all sorts of analytical operations on data tables that are required in business and science. These are applications like business intelligence and analytics, estimations and predictions based on historical data, and particularly commission and performance calculations in industries like financial services, and reporting. What is a table function? Table function is a function with data tables as input and output parameters. You may compare a table function to a matrix function from linear algebra with the difference that table functions have tables as parameters instead of matrices. Table functions of FinaQuant libraries operate on in-memory tables. This has some obvious advantages like performance, flexibility, and independence from any data structure of a database. What kind of table functions are there in the library? As you see, the list is quite extensive. The purpose of this library is replacing case-by-case -case database programming by table functions for all sorts of analytical operations. You can automate your periodical calculations, the whole calculation process, by using nodes and networks for tasks like reading input tables from multiple databases, input validations, executing the configured table functions to generate output tables, and storing all these result tables to desired data stores. Each calculation node is an independent unit of the network, which resembles a worker ant in a giant colony. A calculation node can read multiple input tables from different data sources, it can be configured so that certain events are triggered at each stage of the calculation process. And it has the ability to read and store tables for each calculation instance. This is quite useful for periodical calculations with several dimensions like year, country, version, scenario, and so on. How to get started with this .NET library? It's quite easy, two steps only. First, download and install the library. And second, download and open the Visual Studio file, FinaQuant called Starter. This Visual Studio file is the best training tool one can imagine. In order to run a demo function, just uncomment it and press this button or F5 to run. You can find here a demo for each type of table functions like importing, exporting, elementary row, column operations table arithmetics, filtering tables, date sampling, applying a formula on 
table and you can find here even a complete example for the calculation of sales commissions. Please send your questions and comments to our community forum. We try to answer every question within two work days. This is the end of my little presentation. Goodbye and have a nice day.